Hey friend, welcome back to the channel. And if you are new here, I am Crystal. I would love it if you would subscribe. If you can tell from the title of the video, I'm gonna show you all the things that I have been hauling lately. We have some home decor, some fashion, some tech stuff, some beauty, quite a few things that I have been holding on to and happy to share with you. So if you wanna see what all I have been hauling, then keep watching. <laughs> gonna jump right in this is gonna be a real comfortable casual style haul video I did work from home today so I get to wear my little moo moo and be comfortable that's the best part about working from home girl you can just be comfortable and you know free <laughs> but um yeah so excuse you know I'm just looking how I'll be looking y'all know old wash and go um yeah I'm just I'm just out here but I'm going to start off with the home decor because you guys know I have been working on this house, getting everything switched up. And I promise I'm going to show you in a dedicated video. I just don't like to show you as I'm doing it because I'll be living in chaos, honey. Chaos and I don't want to show you all that. So um, I'm going to show you once it's all clean and pretty and put together. But I can just show you the pieces that I... I'm going to have in the house just in case you're doing some changing up to and you want to go find some things go to these stores okay this is um ross tj maxx burlington dds yeah i think that's all what we have marshall's if i didn't say that um so i'm going to start with the home decor and let me tell you this video is a testimony of what is meant for you is for you, okay? Because y'all remember I went to Burlington, got some stuff. Well, I went to Burlington, looked at some stuff. I didn't get it because the line was too long. And so I went back and everything was, that I had saved was gone. And my little feelings was hurt. However, what it was meant for me because I went back to a different Burlington on the other side of town and I found a friend. This is what I was looking for. I have the smaller version of this and I wanted the bigger one because I have um, a place to put it on my entertainment center. So I wanted the small one on one shelf, the big one on another shelf. And I found it and I love it. And it's so cute, right? So cute. This was $12.99. Hopefully you can see that. I do have a ring light going on and other lights because I can't see, so I feel like you can't see, but let me know if it's too much lights going on and we can try to adjust that. These eyes, honey, these eyes getting old and um, I can't see in the dark. So yeah, that's what I got. It was for me, look at that. She is so cute. I love her. I love her. So that is the first thing that I picked up the next thing I picked up, this actually came from, where did this come from? This came from Ross. It is $13.99. And this is what it looks like. This is actually the back and this is how I may display it. And I'm thinking about putting some writing or something on the back. I have like some decals or something I can put on there. Only because this is what the front looks like and I'm not really sure how I feel about the front. I mean, the chair in my living room does have these little studs or whatever these are called. So it would kind of go, but I kind of don't like it. So if I keep it, I don't know. I'm just going to have to see in the space, I guess. But this is like a little stand that you can put somewhere and be cute. So that's what I got. And again, I might display it backwards with some other things on the table. And just, just to show you, friend, look at that. Look at that on the table. Oh, that's so cute. Like, girl, looking cute. Looking real, real cute. Um, I have some other cute things that I'll, I'll go with that. So I'm trying to reach over here to grab it. The next thing I picked up was this little love sign. This is the love sign. And... Um, 
Yeah, this is what it's looking like. It was $7.99 at Ross. This is what it looks like. It's so cute, so cute. I'm either gonna sit this on the little entry table when you first come in, or it's gonna go on the bookshelf in my office or on my office desk. I'm not sure where it's gonna go, but this is what it looks like. And it's so, so cute. It goes with my whole aesthetics. I love it, I love it. I got two of these. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep these because I'm not sure if I like them or not, but I think they go for sure with the aesthetics, but I don't really like the the chain. I was wanting more of the, the little circles because I have a few of these type of strings, if you wanna call links. I don't know what you would call these. I have some of these beads like this. So I was wanting some more beads that's big, but they didn't have them at Ross. So I got these while I was there and I always can take them back if it doesn't um, do what I wanted to do. And it was $9.99 for these. So I did pick up two of those. And you know, you just kind of lay them, drape them over a book or bookshelf. You know, you can do different stuff with them honey I, I don't know i'm getting i'm trying to be creative on the fly you know you can just kind of prop them on the shelf some kind of way honey i don't know but it's gonna be cute once i figure out what to do with it but yeah i got two of those the next thing i picked up was this welcome sign very cute very cute and it came from ross at 6.99 and again, I'm not sure where I'm going to put it. I have quite a few little cubby areas to fill. So um, I'm going to put it there, maybe on the entry table, just so when you come in, you know you're welcome, friend. You're welcome. So that's why I picked up this one. This is the last piece of the home decor. Friend, look how gorgeous this is. Oh, my goodness. They had two, um, picked up one. I wish I had got the other one now because they look so real, realistic, gorgeous. I got this to go here in the bathroom to sit on my vanity because I absolutely love flowers. And oh my gosh, this is gonna make me so happy every morning when I come in here to get ready to see these flowers looking so cute. I was thinking if I get the other one, they can go in my bedroom some kind of way. I'm not sure, but I need to go find it and get it if I'm gonna get it because honey, it'll be gone. It came from Ross. No, it didn't. Where it come from? Marshalls. It came from Marshalls for how much, girl? $19.99. That is what it looks like. It has the faux little water in there. And this is so cute. I absolutely love it. It looks so real and so pretty and i'm gonna feel like i have flowers delivered every day fresh flowers they're giving they're giving looking real honey they look real real for twenty dollars oh i think i should go back and get the other one so pretty so pretty that's my favorite purchase out of all the things thus far next i have these bath rugs is this considered home decor i don't know friend i don't know but i have two sets of bath rugs and they are 14.99 and this is the material of it so um plush and soft just imagine your little toes in there when you get out the bathtub just sinking in there all oh, soft girl and um, I got two sets because um, the bathroom can, it's kind of big. So two sets will be nice. So I got two for me in this bathroom. And then another time I picked up this one to go in the guest bathroom. This came from Ross, $15.99. I was wanting another one like that because I haven't had any bath mats like that before that's that plush type of material i have i have mats like this all the time so i'm not sure if i'm gonna keep it if i can find another one like that that's all plushy and stuff i will switch it out um so i'm gonna be on the lookout probably this weekend but this is the one for the guest bathroom i do have to get some new shower curtains and some new um 
hand towels and stuff to go with the new aesthetics. Taupe is my color. I guess I am turning into a neutral girl, okay? A lot of people be talking about us on the internet saying we neutral is, you know, don't do neutral. But I have done color gold and bronze and all that for so long. Burgundies that I want to lighten it up a bit. So I'm going to go with some neutral colors. I'm going to be one of those neutral girls. So that is it for all of the home decor. Let's move on to the clothing items that I have. Next, moving on to the clothing. I didn't get much. Is this considered clothing? This is this Escape beach bag, honey. It's a beach bag and it just says Escape. It came from Ross. It's $13.99 and she is huge and can fit all of your stuff, honey. As soon as I saw it, I had to get it. Look at these little beads. I mean, seashells. I don't have any plans to go on any vacations or anything like that, but I want to. And when I go, I'm taking this escape bag because I'm gonna be escaping. So let me scoot back so you can see what it looks like. I absolutely love the bag. Look how big it is. It can fit my laptop. It can fit some sandals, a water bottle, a book. I mean, it is huge for $13.99. I am in love with this. So if you're going on a vacation, they have different kinds too there. So if you're going on vacation, need a nice little beach bag, check out Ross. I think the beach bag is so cute. And I'm going to go on a vacation or a cruise or something. So that's where I got it. Okay, Jesus, I want to go on a cruise. So speaking into existence, Lord. Um, and the next thing that I picked up was just some a few clothing items. Y'all know I am trying to put some color in my life. And so I got this little dress. It's just a blue dress with a little paisley, paisley print to it. That's what it looks like. It was $9.99 at Ross. $9.99. Just a cute little paisley type of thin summer dress, something cute that I can wear to church that's not black. I'm trying to get color in my life. Speaking of black items, I did get some things that are black. Of course, I had to. Black is going to always be in the wardrobe some way, somehow. This is just a little sweater because it is cold in the building. And so I just picked up this little black uh, cardigan that you can wear with over anything. It's long. Um, has some little pockets in it. I put my little badge in there at work. So just picked up a little black cardigan. I think it's cute. That was $9.99. And then I also picked up this little skirt, honey. I don't know where I'm going in this skirt. I'm going to wear it to work, I think. But it's just a little skirt with some pleats on it. A little pleated skirt. Very cute. It's long. I feel like it's going to be cute in the fall with some tall boots or something. I'm not really sure how I'm going to dress it up. I'm going to look on Pinterest and try to find some, some little fashion ideas to see how to wear this. Because I've seen some girls wear these type of skirts with like um, a t-shirt and they'd be looking real cute. So I'm going to see if I can pull that off, honey. I don't know. But it was $7.99 for this little skirt. Next, I picked up these little cute little sandals because again, all the sandals I own are black. I don't have any sandals that are not black. So I wanted to get some new sandals. So I picked these up and got this from Burlington. It was $7.49 on clearance. Just some cute little neutral sandals to go with some of these dresses. I think these are cute. The last clothing item I picked up was just some little pajamas. I got these at Ross for $16.99. And just some pajamas because I really only have like my little dresses, my little moo-moos. I have like some dresses. I don't really have like that many pajamas that are pants. Oh, I didn't show you. These are some pants, like some some capris, some just some capris, and this is what they look like. Just some gray little capris to lounge around in the house. And I picked those up. 
The last clothing item, I forgot I had this. This is this little linen, look how cute this is. It's black, I know, but I had to get it when I saw how cute it was. It is a linen uh, two-piece set. It's given beach, right? It's given go to the beach and lounge around and be cute and comfortable. This is what the bottom looks like. This is the top, just a little button-up top. Very cute, very cute top. You will definitely see this in some type of vlog when I go somewhere because I think it's so cute. And um, yeah, I know, I'm, I know I'm trying to get away from black. However, I felt like this was okay because it's still different for me. For me, it's um, this pattern. And you know, I don't do patterns, honey. I just do uh, black and white. I mean, I do patterns like in the house when I ain't going anywhere. But if I'm outside in the world, honey, I don't have patterns on. And so we got this for some pattern. And we're going to see how it look. I'm going to try to dress it up, put a little jewelry on, try to look a little cute, look like a little something, honey. But um, yeah, next we'll move on to techie things. I didn't get too many techie things, just some things that I needed. The first one is this wireless mouse, and this is what it looks like. You've seen a wireless mouse. It says that it works for Mac. I did have a wireless mouse, but honey, one of them kids then took over it, so I had to get another one. This was $6.99. And then I picked up this nine outlet wall adapter, and it has two USB ports. And what I liked about it is how it connects here and then goes out with all the extra outlets. Because in my beauty room, the top outlet is where my alarm system is plugged into. So I can't, I mean the bottom, so I can't like remove that one. So I'm hoping that this fits on the top and then I'll have all this extra room to plug up my my um my mirror the lights all that so i got it it was how much was this this was 12.99 and nine outlets with the usb i feel like that was a, a really good deal hopefully it fits where i need it to fit but that is all of the techie things now what you all have been waiting for is the beauty stuff right i know that's is that my favorite part not really because right now i'm in love with home decor but let's move on to the beauty things i got some nails i got some honey i got some good stuff so let's just move on okay now on to the beauty things i went in the store looking for some shea moisture conditioner for my son because i think they are discontinuing it and the only place I can find it is at TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington. It is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil line within Shea Moisture. I think they're discontinued it because I can't find it anywhere. So I went there looking for it for him because he's all out and they did have some. So I was that person who got all of them, all that they had. I got all of them. It was like six bottles of it, but he took it on in his room. So um, I'm going to show you what I got for my hair. And I have talked about this Maui brand before on the channel a long time ago when I was wearing my hair curly. And I hope you have checked it out. I know some of you told me you did go get some of it, um, but I absolutely love the Maui. And I'm actually wearing this one in my hair right now. It is the Coconut uh, Curl Smoothie and i'm just about out of it so i was happy to see that they had it in these stores because it's on the discount so i picked up the shampoo this is what the shampoo looks like and it's 4.99 i don't know if the price is on here they were 4.99 each so that is the shampoo and then i don't shampoo my hair that much but i do use conditioner so I picked up two of the conditioners. That's what they look like. Very cute and aesthetically pleasing to me. And I'm sure they smell so good. They're in the vanilla bean scent and smell so good. It smells like some, like a body butter that I have in my collection. So it's just vanilla. And it says for a frizzy, unruly hair. Mm. 
I wouldn't say my hair is unruly, but I just like that brand, that line. And they had all kind of stuff. So I got a little bit of everything because I want to try it at a discounted price. So I picked this up. This is some, what is this? Some edge control gel. Yes, some edge gel is what it is. And it was $3.99. We're gonna see, y'all know my little edges is bald headed, honey. I got a lot of hair, but these edges is bald headed. And um, I still need to figure out what I'm gonna do with these edges. So I'm just gonna slick them down for now. So I, I got some of this to slick them down. We're gonna see. And then I picked up two of the Curl Oil Gels, and this is what it looks like. It was $4.99. Again, I will let you see what it looks like while I read it. It's Curl Oil Gel. It has castor and neem oil, honey, neem oil. I can't read. And it's for damaged or transitioning curls is what it says. Are my curls damaged? Um, some of them are kind of looser than others, but that's how I like it though. So we're just gonna see how it does. Um, I just wanted to try it out. I got two just in case it does really well because I really like that one I have. It don't really smell the greatest, but as long as it do what it's supposed to do. It says curl oil gel, so hopefully it doesn't get crunchy and flaky. If you have used this before, comment down below. Let me know, that's what it looks like. It's kind of loose. It's not like a smoothie or anything like I normally use in my hair, but it's kind of loose and liquidy. So we're gonna see, honey. Comment down below. Let me know if you have tried this before. Do you like it in your hair? Um, I will let you know when I try it if it does well. Last thing I picked up from the Maui line is this coconut milk hair mist. And this is what it looks like. It was, how much was this friend? It was $4.99 as well. And it's supposed to be a light weight or weightless oil mist just to give me a little shine because sometimes when these curls, this is like an old wash and go from, honey, a couple of days and um, sometimes I'll just wear it like this and just spray some oil on it to be, you know, not looking all dry. So I'll just do that. So we got this just to see what we think about it. Next thing I got was this pack of shower caps is what it is. And I needed some new shower caps. So I picked these up, they waterproof and reusable. They keep your hair intact and dry. And this is because I'm wearing my hair curly. So we're gonna see how it does. Just wanted to try a new type of shower cap and it was $5.99. Next I have this bathing oil and it's by The Beauty of Eczema. I have told you before, I do have a little bit of eczema. And so I picked this up so I can put it in my bath water. Right now I do use the oil whenever I soak in the tub and I just wanted to try something new. So this is what it looks like. We are gonna see. Let me smell it and see if it smells like anything. It has no scent at all whatsoever. And um, yeah, that's what we got. We're gonna give it a try and, and see. I also picked up this comb while I was there. I'm not really sure what this comb is gonna do, but it's supposed to be a rotating detangler comb. And it says it gently detangles your hair. It's for natural and textured hair. It is a $3.99. I figured it can't hurt. Just give it a try while we're wearing our hair curly just to see if it does anything. So I just picked that up. Also picked up this micro crystal dark spot cover. These are just like some little patches you put on your face. So whenever I break out, I get a little spot. So I have a few spots that I'm going to try to heal or, you know, get, get right. So you're supposed to put these on your face and it's supposed to help lighten up the dark spots. I think I purchased something like this before. I need to go look in that beauty room and see 
and try them out, but we picked these up. It was $3.99. Also, I picked up some makeup brushes. This is from the Real Techniques and this is the brushes i picked it up for this brush right here this brush is so cute it's like an angled brush and it says it's the expert edge foundation no that's not what it is what is this i don't know which but soft accent brush it's called a soft accent brush whatever that means but I just like the shape of it. I don't think I have purchased this little Real Technique set before. I might have to go look at some of my videos to see and look at my brush drawer to see if I have it. But this was the only reason I wanted this is for this little angled brush. Look at that angle. Girl, I don't know what we're going to do. We can pack on some something with this. I love Real Techniques. They are a very good brush line. I don't think I have it. But this brush is making me think that I do because I know I have seen this somewhere before. Maybe not. I don't know. I'll have to look, but that's cute. Got a little angle to it and you can contour with it. So, okay, real technique. Let me just look at all the brushes since we're, since we're here. Since we're here, let's just do it. So this is the lip smudger brush honey i'm making up stuff let me, let me just read the box it says this is the smudge liner brush okay smudge liner brush and i don't think i'll be smudging any liner with it but i may like oh that's gonna be real good to carve out them eyebrows with so okay okay then and then the names are on the brushes while I'm trying to read the package. This is the Lip Smudge Brush. That's what it looks like. And I like this. Y'all know, whenever I wear a lip liner, I always kind of smudge it together. And then the last one is a Spotlight Fan Brush. That's what it looks like. I really don't use a lot of fan brushes because I only use these really for highlight. So... I mean, if I'm gonna do some highlight, I got a brush. So that's that. Last but not least, friend. Last but not least, I picked up some nails, honey. But let me just get them all together. I know I have done two nail hauls recently. If you have not checked out those videos and you like nails, go check those out. But while I was there, they had some new ones, some that I didn't have, some that they didn't have when I was there before. So I had to, I just had to pick them up. So this is the first set, just some cute gold glitter. So pretty. I really like these. That's what it looks like. Hopefully it's not a glare. So cute. This next set, um, it's a little bit different but we're gonna try it it's just like some french tips with black on the ends very cute very cute and different for me i saw somebody on instagram with some black kind of french tips and i thought it was cute so why not let's just try it these are 4.99 this first set was 5.99 these last two are 4.99 and 5.99 so this one is from Ardell. I did show you one of these in a previous nail haul, but I didn't have this color. This is kind of like a muted purple kind of color. I hope you can see. I hope the glare. I probably should turn off the ring light, but that's what it looks like. That purple is so cute and so neutral. I absolutely love that. And the last one I think I have these. I'm not buying any more nails until I go through my nail collection because I think I have these, but they're so cute and I couldn't leave them because they're cute, but I think I have these. I'm going to go through my collection. I'm not going to buy anything else. Stay tuned. There'll be a nail collection video coming up at some point, but this is the last pair. So cute. All those pinks will be perfect for now. Those dark colors will be good for the fall. So I'm not sure if I'm going to wear it now or wait till the fall. But so cute, so cute, I like that. But that's gonna be all for my huge collective 
haul of random things. If you like haul videos, give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. Are you looking for anything? Are you going out shopping? Are you getting new home decor? Let me know if you're one of the friends who like nails. I love nails, as you can see. And this is the current little set I am wearing right now because I am doing some painting around the house. So I need some short little cute nails. But I'm not going to ramble anymore. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>